on the brink of World War Three, what could be more important than what's written on the side of a fucking chocolate egg? Nothing. <laughs> The famously hate-fueled anti-Christian group, the National Trust, faced the wrath <laughs> of the Prime Minister this week when they failed to use the word Easter in posters advertising their posh elitist egg hunt in the grounds of some chinless inbred country estate. The evil fucking bastards. <laughs> it's time like this, I asked myself, what would Noel Edmonds do? So I want to take a moment, like Noel would do, to address the National Trust. Directly. <laughs> Who do you think you are, the National Trust? <laughs> Last time I checked, this was a Christian country. And as a Christian country, the National Trust, we don't say the words egg or chocolate or hot cross buns. We call them by their proper religious names. Easter egg, Jesus's chocolate, and the tight hot buns of the Virgin Mary. <laughs> you know what, the National Trust? I think there's an agenda here, and it's an evil one. I think you're dropping the word Easter because you believe that modern Britain is a polytheistic, inclusive society. And you think more people of all races, creeds, colours and beliefs will turn up to your egg hunt if you don't refer to Easter. When our Lord was... What was he born? No, that's Christmas. Well, anyway, it doesn't matter. All that matters, the National Trust, is in your relentless pursuit of money. You happily deny this country's faith in order to try and include all sorts of people who are heathens in your godless egg hunt. What's next, the National Trust? Are you going to convert Longley into a massive mosque? <laughs> or maybe you're going to transform Corfe Castle into a massive mosque. <laughs> or maybe, just maybe, next time I go to Hatfield House to pay my respects to the first Queen Elizabeth, it'll just be a massive mosque. Anyone who's ever paid 35 quid for a pen shaped like a little sword and a small jar of marmalade <laughs> will know just how evil the National Trust is. But in the end, it all turned out to be bollocks, this story. Because uh, actually, the National Trust did use the word Easter all over their advertising for this egg hunt, but some twat journalist edited that out so Theresa May and Archbishop John Santamu could give confused and ignorant sound bites, which in turn led to mustachioed elderly majors in small south coast towns turning red and muttering about how Dorset would never willingly adopt Sharia law when actually everything was exactly the same as it's always been. Susie, Theresa May stuck her oar in, didn't she? Yeah. Which was uh, a bit unusual for her. <laughs> uh, there's plenty of stuff going on to get properly upset about, isn't there? Does she just hate eggs? No, she's not only a vicar's daughter, mm. but she's a member yeah. of the National Trust, as she told a plane a full of journalists on her yeah. way to sell guns to the Saudis. <laughs> the most important thing that they could be talking about right then was why the National Trust and Easter eggs had all fucked up the entire world and it's got nothing to do with guns and Saudis at all. You know, Easter isn't Christian. Mm. It's, uh, it's, not, it's not even basically pagan. There's a whole bunch of religions all around the world who think this time of year is all about not eggs, not Jesus, not resurrection. It's about... Fucking. Uh, Fundamentally... Is that why the Easter, rabbits are involved? Yes. Ah. Fundamentally, <laughs> Easter is about a, pe a time of the year when new life begins. How does new life begin? Fucking. Mm. Easter is about fucking, the eggs are about fucking, the bunnies are about fucking. The whole Christ thing put on the top of it is fucking accidental. So Christ appropriated Christ nicked the, fucking the fucking festival. And took all the fun out of it. Mm. Andy, is it true that rabbits shit chocolate at Easter? Because that's what I heard. Yeah, it is, yeah. I used you to have a rabbit. rabbit droppings, yeah. that's how you... Uh, we used okay. to have a rabbit and it's about, it's about halfway through Lent when right. it turns from shit to chocolate and it's quite hard to find out which is, when that point is. You just without... have trial and error. Yeah, it's trial, trial and, and error. error. Exactly. What's the most Easter eggs you've ever eaten, Sandy? Mine's eight and I was hospitalised. Can you beat that? Yes. <laughs> really? Yes, I can. But they were the small ones. The small ones, what, yeah. like, are we talking so, like those yeah, mini Cabri's Yeah, those mini Cabri's yeah, OK, mini but that, that doesn't <laughs> quite count. Thanks, panel, <laughs> that was rich and compelling.